呃。For those of you who don't know, I have MS, and my problems are cognitive. If I um, my if I get confused a little bit, or my slur with my speech just a little bit, or if I kind of you know use filler words like um or ah, uh, please um just bear with me, okay? I I'm trying not to, but you know what happens. All right. Okay, door monitor. Gracie, over here. Over here. I need to remember to call the, the gas tank people to get them to move the gas tank so it's not in front of my teepee. Nobody will want to use my teepee with the gas tank in front of it. Yeah. Okay. Okay, here we go. Yeah, I've got a couple trolls. Yeah, I do. And that's okay. <laughs> because trust me, they are trolls. Yeah. <laughs> and so, okay. Wait, guys, let's not waste any more time, shall we? Let me get my onion press or my garlic press. And it's going to be the last place I look. Told you. Okay. Out of here, Scratchy. Okay. We're going to need a couple cloves of garlic. Um, I like a lot of garlic. I'm a garlicky person. And, um, you know, my great-grandma, um, she used to eat garlic cloves by, by the whole. She would, you do this, and then... And eat the whole thing. And oh my gosh. <laughs> God bless you, Tanya. <laughs> and I remember one time, and because I really liked grandma and um I loved her. But she became a really cranky lady in her really old age. But anyway, she deserves it. She lived to be 98. Okay. So um do they live under a bridge? Well, I don't know about that, but I heard that they lived in a van down by the river. <laughs> okay. <laughs> now everybody's got trolls, though. Every creator gets trolls. I'm just, I, I should have known. Yeah, and it doesn't bother me really anymore. It doesn't change my numbers, so, okay. If it ruined my channel, then um, I would have a problem with that. But you know what? I'm the only one that can ruin the channel. <laughs> okay. So now I've got my three cloves of garlic. Let's get these crushed. Yeah. I think you're okay. Alaska. Hey, is Alaska in here? Oh, gosh, I don't know what you guys are talking about. It's not, and you know what? Some half the time you guys aren't talking to me, and I look up at the chat, and I think you're talking to me. Yeah, it's not all about you, Calamity. Gosh. <laughs> okay. Just squeeze it real good. Get it out of the skin. Squeeze it like it's a, a big pimple on the end of your nose. Just go for it. <laughs> yeah. And um but you know, okay guys, one thing that we're going to that we're doing is um we're develop we've uh, developed kind of like a point a little point system. And um I'm very soon because we've been talking about it long enough, um I'm going to raffle something off. Something that I make that I can send to you. And I'm wondering if I can send something like these Reese's Peter Butter Cups that I made. And, you know, and here's the, here's the, the inside. You guys, they're so delicious. Um, 
Uh, Tanya said if I vacuum, you know, wrapped them, that it, they, it would probably work. You guys think so? What do you think? Because I got to know. Um, let me see. Okay, so I go to the doctor yesterday, my pain doctor, right? And um, we're talking about how I'm having problems with my legs and my feet. Um, and so she says, well, um, oh, let me wash my hands while I, um, or you guys can watch me wash my hands. Um, so she says, well, one thing with your restless leg, and you guys, my restless leg syndrome is so bad. It's one of the worst that um, my doctor has seen. And she says that a lot of it is because it's going on all the time during the day. But when you're up and around and stuff like that, you don't notice it because you're walking around. But when you stop and relax, that's when you notice it because that's what um, uh, you've stopped moving. It's like, it's like um, when it's dark over in New Zealand, we can, and they're having, you know, the Aurora Borealis going, you know, down there from the, from the South Pole. And they do get southern lights. I verified that. Well, anyway, it's not like they're not going off still in the daytime, you know, or here. You know, if they're going off, you know, up in Alaska, they're still going, even though it might be daytime. So anyway, um, so that's how that works. And she said that the more that you constrict your legs, like, you know, this, you know, or, and I said Indian style constantly. She said that is, um, that's like uh, an accelerant for it. My, of course, my favorite way to ways to sit, sheesh. But you no, know, that's okay. That's how it rolls. So I'm I got to get a um, a foot stool for my desk and sit at my desk more when I edit instead of on my <laughs> Chase Lounge <laughs> where it's nice and comfortable where I can stretch out and then when I want to, you know, go crisscross applesauce like they say to the kindergartners. But not gonna happen here. Hugh, hi, hi, Hugh, hoodie who? That's what wakes me. My leg that freaks out. Yeah, the freak out kicks me. Yeah, this this restless leg syndrome. It's horrible, horrible. And the the older you get, the worse it gets. Just letting you know if you have it. I'm donning the Michael Jackson protection glove this turns me into a star yeah okay so let's cut up some onion get some fresh onion fresh garlic in there and um so what else did i go um i was so busy this weekend i put out a whole bunch of shorts you guys I think like um, six, I think. And so that really kept me busy. And um, and then, you know, I went to town yesterday. And then um, uh, oh my gosh, you guys, my dog, poor Gracie. Okay, Gracie has a fan club, I understand. And um, well, she has been on steroids because she's got really bad asthma. Hey, my coffee. Good to see you, sweet pea. Hey, um, vlogs, did you leave? Did our new friend vlogs leave? Did you vlogs? Uh-huh. <laughs> I hope not. Um, and so, well, sometimes in the middle, because steroids, I don't know if any of you have been on them. But for those of us who have autoimmune diseases like mine, like multiple sclerosis, um, you get steroids a lot. And um, they make you gain weight. Let me model for that. The steroids, they make you gain weight. 
I'm modeling for that. Yes. <laughs> that just cracked me up. Well, anyway, um, uh, well, you drink a ton of water because you're extra, extra, extra thirsty. And then with um, the water comes to pee, right? <laughs> oh, thank you, Nikki. <laughs> hey, oh, Vanessa with an L. Today's episode is brought to you by Vanessa with an L. Hi, Vanessa, sweet pea. Yeah. Lori Baird, you're on steroids now. So you understand what Gracie's going through. Well, sometimes I don't hear her the way that she asked to go to the potty. So she went potty on my carpet. Yeah. Uh, mine's not steroids. It's ice cream. I love ice cream, but I have been a good girl. I haven't been eating ice cream much lately. I haven't been keeping it in the cabin. Um, you guys, um, we are about ready to have a huge thunderstorm. And so it just got really dark. And so if I lose connection, stay. Don't go anywhere because I will come back. Okay, so we've got our garlic and our onion cut up. That's what we need to do. Okay. And then let's start our process. We know how it goes. Hey there. Hey there, lonely girl, lonely girl. I don't know why I'm singing that old song, but I am. Let's cook. Okay, we got to get our pan or our pot screaming hot. Remember that? So let's get it screaming hot before we throw in our oil. I need to get some more um, uh, high temperature oil, like an avocado oil or something like that. I keep forgetting. Um, yeah, I was going through my cupboard today. I need to get a few things. Yeah, so, um, but yeah, what would you guys think of? Um, uh, I hate Candace, honey. You know, I, Candace is one of my one of my um, good friends from school. Um, oh, okay, yeah, yeah. Thank you for reminding me. Okay, and pull and okay. So after we get this going, uh, oh, Candace, I forgot to tell you. Um, uh, I went to school with a girl named Candy Rosander. And her name was Candace, and she was um, a really, really neat friend that I had for many, 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 many years. And um, then she ended up moving to um, uh, a way far away from us. And then we met up. I was staying at a friend's house in um, Vegas. Uh, well, gosh, I was still flying then. Um, and so this was, what, 15 years ago. And um, uh, she came over and hung out and swam in the pool, and it was so good to see her. <gasps> Eggsy, hi, honey, how are you? Thank you for your sweet message. I got it. Thank you. Yeah. Um, okay, guys, let's get some oil in this pan. Yeah, so Candy Rosander. Yeah, and um, she lived in Las Vegas, too. And at the time when I had Facebook, um, hang on, I got to tell you guys something. I'm going to put in a little bit of butter. And the reason why is because when you put some garlic, um, I'm sorry, some uh, oil uh, in the bottom of a, of a pan, uh, with, and okay, you have oil in the bottom of the pan. <laughs> and, and then... Um, you put in your garlic and it bur it can burn. Well, if you put in a tab of um, butter, your garlic won't burn. Yeah, I learned that from Cookie. Yeah, I sure did. 
You know what, Eggsy, you make all of us girls just feel like um, that we are just um, beautiful and gorgeous. <laughs> so thank you. Michelle H. Hi, honey. Hey, I have a question for you. You got me that Calamity Girl uh, necklace that I always wear for, for my birthday. I need to know where you got it from because... Um, Okay, I will. Uh, just a second, Nikki. Uh, thanks for asking me. Um, I'm looking for a silver one. And I like that that one. So I want to... Um, uh, I want to um, order one in silver. Because I like that. I love it. So... Okay, let's put in some onions. Woo! Okay, and we're going to cook those until they are translucent. Okay? Or transparent, unlike some of our politicians, but we don't go there because we're not a political channel. Right, Nikki Noodles? Right, Jaffo? We're not. Let me throw in my garlic. Did you guys? I just have to ask. Did anybody besides me watch the has been asked before, but I love the name Calamity. Where is it from? Oh, tacos? <laughs> well, Calamity is, well, you know what a Calamity is. A Calamity means it's a disaster. That's me. Because I am a disaster, you just get to know me and you'll see that I'm just a, because I'm a, I'm the walking poster child for ADHD. That's me. And, um, and let me see what else. Um, and, oh, well, how I uh, came up with the name Calamity was, um, my girlfriend, Lisa, and I were goofing around with YouTube one day, and we decided to start a channel. Well, she's passed on. She's no longer with us anymore. However, Calamity Girl is. See, she was supposed to be the behind the scenes, and I'm not. I was supposed to be in front of the camera because she was camera shy. Well, I'm a ham. Well, anyway, hey, Sandy boy. How are you doing, honey? Um, uh, until she interviews the carving of Irishman. That's right. Tomorrow, now tomorrow, I might postpone it until Tuesday. Maybe. Maybe not. It depends on how our... Um, uh, well, you know, tons, I'm wondering if I should do it tomorrow or um, on Tuesday because then we have more time to advertise for it. What do you think? Okay, Jaffo, what do you think? Oh, Eggsy, thank you. Thank you. <laughs> oh, Sandy boy. That's not Candy boy, that's Canada boy. Yeah. Okay, then Tuesday. Okay, Tuesday, I am interviewing tons of fun. Yeah, our Irishman friend. And he and I are distant cousins. We just don't know each other, and we don't know how we're related. But we're both Irish, so yeah, that, that counts. Okay, so back to the, back to the bisque. Okay, I have got the onions going. So now I want to do this correctly. Okay, got to put in the pepper. So put in some fresh ground pepper. And you're probably going to go for a half a teaspoon. Okay, and then, of course, your salt. But let's talk salt for a second. We all know how much of a fan I am of Redmond salt. Okay. 
to pink salt. Those sparkles in there are just not happy sparkles, but they are minerals. And it, you don't have to go to the Himalayans. You don't. Because it's right here in our backyard. It's outside, just outside of Salt Lake City, Utah. And it's from an ancient mine. And it's probably the best tasting salt you've tasted. Because salt, trust me, salt is not salt. Yeah. So let's get some Redmond's salt on there okay yeah salt isn't salt you guys um especially pink salt is the best iodized salt that um has uh extra iron in it um and it's uh basically what um table salt is and it's just a white you know just a white salt but um it's <laughs> It's not that good for you. Pink salt is the way to go. Okay. So, all right. So now we need to make some chicken bouillon. So, well, I need a tablespoon of bouillon. And I'm going to put in... Okay, and then let's get some water for that. And I want to give a huge shout out to Tons of Fun's mother. Um, I don't know, ma'am, if you know, but you and I are related too. See, we're both Irish. Yes, we are. And we enjoy having your son around. Thank you. Thank you for watching the program the way you do. Yeah. And so I just wanted to say hello. And okay, Michelle, we need to talk. I've been in an overly, uh, okay, rough spot at the moment. I'm also recently lost another dear friend due to suicide. Oh, Michelle, I'm so sorry, baby. Oh, honey, I'm so very sorry. I'm glad you're here with us. It's good to see you. And are you happy to see this chicken bouillon? Yeah, look. And so that's going right in. Okay. And so I made eight cups. So, whoa, I spilled a little bit on my clean range. Okay. Now we'll get this up to a nice boil because um, that's what we do. Okay, French for biscuits and gravy. Yes. But 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 this um, this is just I, it's always called a tomato bisque. I don't I, I don't know any more about that. <laughs> yeah, but uh, that's all I know about that. You keep potassium chloride powder. Our body needs a balance to run our heart. Good. Oh, you know what? That's ugh. excuse me. I'm having a hot flash again. I'm 53. Am I allowed to have a hot flash? I hope so. <laughs> and again, I'd like to mm, forgive me. Where salty soup is strange. Oh, no, we don't have salty soup. No salty soup here. But let me tell you something. If your soup is too salty, not like overly salty where you just need to take it and pitch it. No. But if your soup is too salty, take a peeled potato, raw peeled potato, and dunk it in there. And um, if it's still a little too salty after about 
20 or 30 minutes, throw another one in. And uh, But if it's just overly, grossly salty, throw it out. <laughs> or use Redmond salt. Actually, we need a little bit more bouillon. Bouillon. Bouillon can get salty. So um, we have to be careful about that. What were you saying to me? Oh, okay. Yeah, I'm 53, Karen. In the middle of menopause. Loving it. Okay, guys. Now, what we're going to do, this gets set aside. And where did that go? Okay. In a minute, we're going to put in some more um, spices. And I didn't forget about paprika. No way did I forget about that. Chickens do eat everything. They do eat everything, but they can't have a lot of salt. That's one thing. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, that's okay, Karen. <laughs> hey, Haxon, how are you? It's really good to see you. Hey, I was thinking about you. I heard about the, fi the fire um, out there. Um, thank you, Michelle. How are you? How are, how's your family doing? Is everybody okay? I dropped my lid. Yeah, accident. I um, was thinking about you and your family. So I'll just wait for an answer. Thank you. I just had some, Karen. Just got some. Okay. I'm going to set that here. Okay, done with that. I'm done with that. Now, okay, you guys are going to think that um, it's going towards Big Bear. Oh, boy, we have a, fa a family cabin up in Big Bear. Um, uh, uh, right by the snow um, ski slopes. But nobody has said anything, so I guess it's okay. Oh. Hey, Nettie, good morning to you, good girl. How are you? Hi, Jethro. I'm so glad to have you share my stuff. This is so great. It helps me out a lot. Okay, so last night on the dinner table was some stromboli. That's why I said it, stromboli. Oh, mm, delicious. But there was some leftover sauce. So I try not to throw food out. As you know, I try to recycle as much as I can. So we're making tomato bisque out of this pizza sauce. Okay? So we're just going to, that's why, this is why I didn't add a whole bunch of spices ahead of time. Because, um, yeah, it's good, huh, Eggsy? Prepare for the dogs to go off. I just saw my son coming down the dirt road. Yeah. And no, it is raining. No, you can't go out. It's raining. Gracie, Gracie, no, calm down. It's raining. Okay, guys. Just Gracie, no. Gracie, no. <laughs> Gosh, Scratchy cannot live without that kid. She can't live without him. He can't live without him. Huh. Uh. What's going on with Nettie? Gosh, I miss so much. See, that's why I go back, you guys. I go back and rewatch the shows, and I read all the chat. So, um... Oh, good news. I've met a nice man. <gasps> you do? Oh, this is good stuff. Let's hear it. Spill the tea, Nettie. Spill the tea. Why I spilled the pizza sauce. 
okay? But so you guys, I'm being careful with my spices that I put in. Um, and you'll notice that I didn't put in a bunch of spices because I have a bunch in here. Tromboli. <laughs> yeah, I, it's good stuff. Hi, honey. How does work? Good. Okay. So here we go. In the pot it goes. Tomato bisque soup tonight with some grilled cheese. Okay. You're welcome. Okay. So now I've added that, but I need to put in some some tomatoes. So we're going to put in some diced, canned diced tomatoes, two of them. All right. Whoops. Okay. Yeah, I haven't had made tomato biscuit in almost a year. Yeah, oops. Okay. Um, okay, let's see. His name is Andrew, and he is from the, um, the town. The SOE town is, oh, it's the, it's the same town as me. Oh, that means no long distance dating. That's great. Oh, Nettie, I'm most happy for you. I'm very happy for you, honey. Um, for those of you who don't know, Nettie lost her husband a couple years ago. And um, it was rather sud sudden to um, cancer. And so she um, has met a nice man. Mm. Thank you, Michelle. Love you. But she loves... Oh, does she tend? We call them canned. <laughs> but yes, tinned tomatoes. Okay. And... Let me get rid of that and that. I don't need that. Um, what do you guys think? Should um, What do you think about some Reese's peanut butter cups? Do you guys think that I should um, uh, raffle some off and make some? Then you guys can watch me make them, and then um, I'll... Vacuum seal them up and um, send them off. Watching a lady in Wyoming wearing flip-flops. Get your boots on. <laughs> I am. And you don't miss a beat, Grandpa Leroy. <laughs> Were you at city council this morning? I wasn't. I'm, I'm taking a little break from, um, from that right now. I've been so busy. I don't have time to watch it right now in the morning. Yeah. Hey, Crossover. Good to see you. Who would say no? Well, let me tell you, these ones I made last night, and I made them out of that Ghirardelli chocolate that I have. And look at the how the middle of them are. Mm, that's right. Yeah. Hi, Danny. Good to see you. I'm so glad you stopped in. Yeah. We're making tomato bisque soup. And we're um, looking to see if I should um, uh, raffle off some of these and then um, vacuum seal. Or another batch, but vacuum seal them and send them off. Yeah. So we'll have to see. Vacuum seal them up. They should be sweet. I think that I can order a vacuum sealer because I don't have one. Now, I had a company approach me about um, a vacuum sealer. And, whoa! I just saw the biggest lightning strike. That's going to crack. Um, 
here it goes can you guys hear it oh the music it cut it darn it um well um last time i did this i um sent some peanut brittle or i did this with peanut brittle and um one of our friends in canada um won it and it cost me fifty dollars however i'm willing to send them um you know uh, i can send them to canada um i have to see how much it, how how much it will cost me because you guys believe me and i'm not i'm not asking for a penny i'm asking for nothing but i don't make hardly anything on youtube not like this not like the live streamers do they get donations constantly and then they get so many watch hours it's impossible for me to do that so but um i'm so thankful and appreciative to my subscribers that um i think that i should try before i commit let me see how much it cost me to send them if it's fifty dollars or under i can do it is after a can of beans <laughs> my my coffee you silly yeah. So, um, but, uh, yeah, I'll look into that and then I'll have an answer for you by, uh, Thursday. Oh, tomorrow's Thursday. <gasps> Wolf Drifter. Hi, honey. Good to see you. Haven't seen you for a while. So, um, I Candace, where do you live? Can you say the country? Are you in the USA? um since australia <laughs> well you and 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 our friends in new zealand you guys are a day ahead yeah i always fall behind <laughs> okay let's get back to the soup so now we are going to i have to get my um in, immersion blender the other channels yeah we do don't we tons yeah we all seem to watch the same channels but um i um i've been kind of taking a break because um i need time i don't have much time um because i'm a one-man band but when i start generating um more funds i'm gonna hire somebody to help me because I can't do it all. It's, it's just too much. Yeah. So I see why these um, people hi, uh, hire out. <laughs> Jaffo, thank you for that gifted membership. I, was, I didn't say that to ask for anything. I didn't. I was just letting you know how it is. Yeah. Um, Michelle H. Oh, I'm so happy. You know, Don, um, I know. And that is, but you know, um, there's a lot of, um, uh, uh, prophecies about that. Yeah. So, Okay, what I'm doing right now is I have my immersion blender. And what this is, is it's just a, a, a blender. And I'm blending everything together because I want it all smooth. I don't want any chunks in there. So no um, onion chunks, no tomato chunks, no... Um, well, I already smashed the garlic like a, like a zit on the nose. <laughs> um, so... And I just about got all of this. Boom. Got it. Okay. Now. Whoops. You go in there. Now. Uh, yeah, that's right. James or Peter Renaday. I don't know who Peter Renaday is. Yeah. Who, who was he? A big fat grilled cheese with that. Hey, that's what we're having with having with this um, Nikki noodles. Yep. 
gourmet grilled cheese is what I call it. Okay, let me taste this to see what kind of things we need to add to it. <laughs> mm, it's a little warm. Oh, I don't need to add any. I don't need to to rig the accident. Thank you. A accident, you're just a sweetheart. You are just a sweetheart. Thank you, sweetie. Um, Jaffa, thank you. Thank you. And so, uh, yeah, so do we agree that the peanut butter cups are the thing to do? Yeah. Um, puppy dog. Yeah, I got one here and I got one here. Scratchy, get out of here. Out the kitchen. Now I need to thicken this puppy up. Okay. Is that what we all agreed on? Okay. So now what I need to do is I need to figure out how Streamlabs is going to do this for us because I still don't know how to put Streamlabs up on my um, uh, screen to where I can, you know, like if somebody decides to sub, you know, that I can actually see who it is or if, you know, um, or if people like the stream or, you know, anything like that. I don't know how to do that. And so um, I have to try and figure that out. Yeah. But I've got, um, I've got, what is going on here? Okay. Let me grab some paste because we need to thicken this, pa this baby up. And if I were the paste, where would I be? I know that it's in here. I had a whole big flat of it. Maybe, speaking of that, maybe it's over here. <laughs> okay. Let me, let me go check. Hang on. Okay, I'm going to try this one more time. Okay. You know what? Jacob is so busy. I don't want to ask him because he's just as busy as I am. Plus, he's got three kids, you know? Okay, I found my, my tomato paste. Got it. Gotcha, 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 good. I looked right past it. Now, wild blue grouse on your property? Yes, sir. Yes, we do. We have, oh gosh. Well, I live, you know, I've shown you where I live. I live in the in the backwoods. I live in the out outback country. And um uh yeah, you're into spring. We're going into fall. You guys, all the leaves are starting to change on the trees. And um, yeah, but yeah, the blue grouse. Oh my gosh, what a dumb, dumb bird that is. Oh my gosh. They will, well, let me turn this down. Okay. Um, these grouse, they will walk in front of in front of you on the road and just sit there. And then here comes all the all the kids doing the same thing. It's crazy. Hey, Shiloh. Online to see a live. Oh, I'm sorry you're sick with the cold, but then I'm kind of glad that you are because you're here with us. Yeah. Hey, Shiloh. I um 
I want to uh, do a proposition, ask a proposition with you, see if you're up to it. Um, not that you have free time or anything. <laughs> um, I need to make um, an intro to my um, uh, to my long form videos. And Bubbles is in the house. Hi, Bubbles. How was school? And um, I wanted to know if you or um, or your um, husband <laughs> would be able to give me a slight hand. And don't answer because I totally put you on the spot. You don't have to answer online or on here. Um, but uh, I need to come up with like a little jingle. And I don't know how to do that myself. And so, and the person that I know who can do it is um, beyond busy. And so I wanted to know if that was something, and there's no hurry, but um, okay, okay. Yeah, her husband, you guys, um, uh, used to be an audio engineer. And they have engineering, an engineer whole thing in their house. Yeah. So, and she sings. And so he mixes her music for her. Yeah, it's really nice. He's the music writer. Oh, he does? Well, only if he's willing to, to you know, give me a hand. And, um, but I don't want to put, I don't want to put anybody on the spot. And if he, you know, just says, Shiloh, I can't do it. I don't have time. No problem. No problem. Yeah. Um, we have not been in school this past week because of the shootings that's been happening here in Kentucky. Oh, Bubbles, are you serious? Bubbles, how are you guys? How are you guys handling that? Are you guys doing okay? Do they are they making sure that? Um, you guys are, uh, are you on a lockdown or what's going on? He'll just want to know what you want so you can email me more details. Okay, Shiloh, I'll email more details. Yeah, that would be, that'd be amazing to even just to, for him to consider it. Um, and so, okay, I've put a can of tomato paste in here. And this, that is going to nicely thicken this up. So I want to show you guys this now. Okay. And then we're going to, sh then while this is cooking, we're, um, I'm going to shoot a um, short video with you guys watching if you want to watch. Was that um, uh, most people in the poll got to? Um, vote but i would like to know what everybody thinks what do you guys think of that look whoa look at how lovely that looks oops and so that is going to thicken up nicely and one last thing that i need to put in there a little bit of cream okay doesn't it look delicious okay I know I love tomato bisque and then about three-quarters of a cup of cream um, there was also a school showing in Georgia geez and one in Nebraska. Okay, what's going on here? What is going on here? Okay, about three quarter cup. And okay, now that is going to um, thicken it up as well. Let me show you. Look at that. Does that look yum? Does that look like you belong in there? <laughs> I guess so. Mm -hmm. Okay. 
I know it does not look terrific. And um, it's all, um, well, it's not 100% vegetarian because I started off with the chicken, uh, chicken stock. Yeah. Hi, Ashley. How are you, sweetheart? Good to see you. I'm so glad that you jumped in to say hi. This is great. Okay. Now, you guys, I have to let our soup cool, or um, I'm sorry, uh, cook on a low and slow. And so now I thought would be fun time to film a short. Do you guys want to see me film a short? Oh, you can call me, Ashley, you can call me Calamity. Go ahead and call me Calamity. Everybody does. <laughs> uh, I'm so glad you're here. And so, okay, guys, um, I'm going to film a short. All right. And so let me just get things situated here. Okay. What do you guys think? Calamity. Boom. That's it. Yep. That's it. That's it, sweetie. Okay. This is gone. Okay, guys. So remember, I'm going to be making, we're going to raffle off Reese's peanut butter cups that I've made. Not these ones. Okay, Nikki, but some other ones. Okay. But this is what they look like in the middle. Mm hmm. Sure, I'll be your mommy. <laughs> no problem, Ashley. I'm happy to do it. Yeah, because my son, my son, he is, he's almost 32. Yeah, so, yeah. So I'm happy to do that, Ash. Oh, uh, oh, I thought it was Ashley. I miss, I miss saw. Oh, gosh. Um, so I'm going to call you Sing. Is that okay? Can I call you Sing? <laughs> yes, you're not Ashley. I know. I just saw that. I see. I don't. I do. I have problems with my eyes, vision issues. Um, uh, what would you like me to call you? Um, uh, Ashish. Ashish. A Ash. Oh, thank you. Thanks, Ash. I appreciate it. Okay. That's a cool name. <laughs> I like it. I like it a lot. <laughs> okay. Um, so I'm having a hot flush again, you guys. Oh, Ash, where are you from? Yes, I do. Thanks, Jaffo. Okay. You guys, I'm going to film a short. You're from India. All right. I do cook. I do cook and I do all, all kinds of stuff. <laughs> but right now I'm going to film a short. So um, are you guys okay with that? Okay. Well, you're going to have to be because I'm going to do it right now. So let me get you in a place where you can see. Okay, and let me move this all back here because I don't need this. Okay, this is what I need. Camera. You guys can't see real well. Okay, okay. Let me put you over here where you can see. Grace, Grace no. Grace, no. That's my dog, you guys. That's, we call her Grace um, or Barky Face. Barky Face is good. Okay. So there you'll be able to see. And I can't believe I'm going to do this while I'm having hot flush. You guys, let's step outside real quick. Because Mama Calamity here is having a... A hot flash. That's what happens when us women get old. Yeah. So. 
No button. No button. No button. Stop. No. No. No button. Okay. Come on out, noodles. Okay. So this is what sorry. This is what we got going on here. So storms are moving in. You guys hear that? Hear that thunder? <laughs> I just need to get my gas tank moved. And um I'm thinking about Airbnb. I gotta get that gas tank moved. That thing right there. And then Matt Borst is coming in October to get his ugly truck. <laughs> um, but I can't have any of that around the teepee. I'm thinking about Airbnb in that. That could be fun. Yeah. So. Right, Dawn? Please tell her. Shh. Gracie. Shh. Gracie. She's used to hearing. Gracie. She's used to hearing that. Oh, you guys. This feels so wonderful but you know it's weird because you guys um every storm what of you yeah ash i'm i'm 53 how old are you ash okay i'm just gonna sit down for a minute because i don't want to be having hot flash um, and do that video. <laughs> You're 16. Oh, wow. Okay, so I've been to India once. I've been to Mumbai. And um, ha, the, I was there when I was a flight attendant. Um, you're, on, you're in on an Airbnb? That might be able to happen. Who knows? Um, I forgot what I was going to tell you. Distracted me. <laughs> um, okay. Uh, oh yeah. Um, having a hot flash during, for my, um, my video, it's not quite appealing, but it happens. So I'm going to do a re, a redo of a video that I shot yesterday. And this video that I shot yesterday, um, it had some problems. And I think that it was with my thumbnail and my title. And so the algorithm spit me out and went away with you, calamity. Yeah. And so um, I only got like 25% views. So I'm going to shoot it again but i can't have the exact same video so but this time i'm going to throw it out to a different audience but you guys will be able to see the um end result of it tomorrow because it'll go out tomorrow so um ever flown into um Bank yes i have yes many times I have, yeah. All the Canadian um, uh, uh, airports, they have Ys in it. Yeah, they have Ys in it. Yeah. Just a, 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 just a random thing that came through. Okay. So, okay, I'd like you to do me a favor. I'd like you to put a one in the chat if you want to watch this short that I do. Um, put a two in the chat if you can care less. Um, oh, yes, yes. Okay. I was a flight attendant. I remember this now, what I was going to say. I was a flight attendant, and um, uh, I went over there, and I went to Mumbai, and um, I'm trying to read at the same time. Hang on. Uh, Ash, I'll tell you in just a second, because... I'm very ADHD. I can't do two things at once. Yeah. You ask the chat. Everybody in here that knows me knows that I'm a disaster like that. You don't know why. Get out of here, my copy. Okay, Jaffo. Grandpa Leroy Don is interested. Come on. He needs to go. 
I don't get it. I don't get it tons. Oh, okay. I get it now. Um, okay. I'm not going to look at the chat. And so, um, well, they bring these um, vendors into the hotel to show you their goods. Well, I wanted to go out and see because that was my only chance at being in India. And um, yeah, it was, uh, I don't know how any, I, I can just say this, how anybody can get a driver's license in Mumbai, India. I don't understand that. I don't understand that. I don't think it's possible. Do you drive yet? Because the legal age here in the States to drive is 16. So I'm just wondering, Ash, if you drive. Okay. I didn't get a good vibe from Ash. Yeah, I didn't either, um, Shiloh. Did Ash leave? Okay, yeah. Um, so, well, anyway, you guys know that story. So let's make, um, let's make this video. Ash was, I think so. I think so. I wondered if it was one of my normal trolls. I don't think so though. I think if that was a new one. Okay. So, okay. Um, let me hook you up and then I'll tell you what this is. I kicked him out because he asked you a nest. Oh, did he? I didn't see it. I didn't see it. Thank you. Thank you, Nikki. Okay. All right. You guys, big shout out to my mods. I do have the best, mod, the best mods. I really do. Um, hey, Lola. Good to see you. You are just in time because I'm about ready to film a short. And I want to show you guys um, what goes on, how um, this uh, is going to get done. So um, I, this is a redo that I'm doing. And um, it is about Dawn dish soap. Okay. So. I don't want to tell you too much about it because you'll be able to see, but um, uh, the shorts is going to be much, or it's going to be much different once it's edited. And um, uh, I think I, I think I know who that may have been. Yeah. Now that I hear what you guys are saying. <laughs> um, and so, Okay, I'm going to start this, but when you guys end up seeing this short tomorrow, it's going to be um, all edited, and it'll be much different than what you see. So let me kind of get this stuff out of the way. Okay. Okay. And... Okay. Ugh. Sleeves. All right. And here we go. <laughs> no. All right. Let's talk dish soap. But let's turn on the camera first. Okay. You guys, I'm not going to get this in one take. I guarantee it. Okay, just a secy. Just a secy. Okay. Let's talk a little Don Dish Soap. Let's talk a little Don Dish Soap, shall we? I'm confused, Don, because on this, it said, on the front of this label, it says that you are a. Um, Don, I, what, what does it say? Dishwashing liquid. 
Don, I'm a little confused because on the front of this, it says that it is a dishwashing liquid. But on the back, and I'm going to insert a photo that you guys can read. On the back, it says that it's for hand washing. There is no talk on the back label about it being for dishwashing. Same with you. Orange, same with you. Dishwashing. Back label, nothing. It only talks about hands. Now, Don, whoops, how about that? Don, here's my question to you. Are you dish soap or hand soap? Wait a minute. Okay. Don, my question to you is, are you dish soap or hand soap? Because if you are dish soap, you should indicate that on the back label. And if you are hand soap, then you need to put it in the hand soap aisle and slash the price. Because hand soap is half the price of the dish soap. So Don, which is it? Is it dish soap or hand soap? I'm going to do that one more time now. Okay. Hey, you fog, I'm in the middle of shooting a short. So, oh no, I've got Blue Dawn here. I've got Blue Dawn. Yeah. Blue Dawn cleans everything. And I'm going to do a short on, oh, Blue Dawn cleans everything. And I'm going to do a short completely on Blue Dawn. I'm just talking about this stuff. Because, whoops, because on here it says that it is a dishwashing liquid on here. But on the back, and I'll quote it to you, it says, I need another pair of glasses. Um, same thing as this one. It says, for hand washing to, for hand washing to decrease bacteria on the skin. That's all it says. So. That's my question, because here's the thing, guys. If it is hand soap, they are mislabeling it, and they are charging you twice as much. That's a problem, because this cost $5, this little one. These cost $7 each, okay? Now, the hand soap comparable you can get a half gallon of hand soap for five dollars so i think there's a little bit of mislabeling ripoff going on here but that's just me so that's why i'm asking the question so i'd like to know what you guys think yeah i'm a huge fan of the blue dawn I think I'll put that in the short. Okay. Take a lot. Here's an extra one. Okay. There's no question that Blue Dawn is the dish soap above dish soaps and it can clean anything. No question about that. The questions that I do have are for these. And that question is for you, Don. Are you dish soap, like you say on the front labels here, or are you hand soap, like you say on the back label? Because if you are hand soap, then you need to have this be in the hand soap aisle and slash the prices. And if it is dish soap, then you need to indicate that on the back label. These are what I have in question, Don. Not blue Don, but these Don. I'm Calamity Girl looking out for you and your wallet. And this is my point of view. I'm Calamity Girl looking out for you and your wallet. And this, it's my point of view. Okay. 
I think I got enough out of that that I can make a good short. Yeah. I love all the things. Pumpkin spice. Ooh, pumpkin spice. Yeah. Hey, Ella. Hoodie who? Hi, Wolf Drifter. With the duck on it. Yeah. Which is it? Is it dish soap? Or hand soap? I think that there's a little bit of mis <clears throat> intentional mismarketing here going on. Whoa. Because let's face it. How many of us read the back labels? We don't, right? Well, we should if we want to save money. Just saying. So, yeah. Um, thank you, Jaffo. I appreciate that. Oh, I need to represent Don. I think that they're going to um, probably kick me out and say, you know, we've had enough of you, Calamity. Yeah, that's what I think. But... <laughs> Um, yeah, I use it to wash wheels and fabric. Well, you know what? I wash carpet with it and you know, I'll do a short, I'm going to do a short with it. Um, because I did a short last night and I hit the video button, but I didn't hit it correctly and it didn't record. And so everything that I use that I used on my carpet, it's gone. So, uh, <laughs> I'm team all soap is soap. They are just trying to make a soap for every little thing. Exactly, Michelle. That's the point is they are trying to do a marketing ploy here because I'm with you. Soap is soap. That's what I'm with you, except for the blue. This will, this, okay. Let me show you, because you guys, you know how my brain, my broken brain works. Okay. Whoa. Okay, so Gracie, no, she's on steroids. And so she is um, near, uh, going to the bathroom a lot. No, no, we're not going outside, no barking. And so she... Um, when you're on steroids, it causes you to have to drink more. And when you drink more, you urinate more, right? Well, she was trying to wake me up one night, obviously, and I didn't, I didn't wake up. And so she went on the carpet and uh, I'm trying to get this to show you. Okay. So what I did, this is drawing right now, but what I did was I took a blanket that has a plastic backing on it, just like this one. And um, I put it there to protect my wood. And then what I did was I took a, whoops, a half a cup of hydrogen peroxide, a half a cup of white distilled vinegar, and a quarter cup of this. It has to be Dawn Blue. It can't be the Facos that they're trying to make go with us. So, and so, <laughs> whoa, that was kind of funny. So I'll get there. I'll, I'll thank Streamlabs. And so, but with that mixture, you mix it all up, and then you pour the whole thing. Joanna, <laughs> right? Uh, and then you pour the whole thing on the stain. And if, thankfully, I had, gosh darn it, okay. Thankfully, I don't have a, um, a padding under it. But if I did, you would still want to do this, but you would want to do it in another way. Um, but what you do is you pour the mixture on there and then you work it in and then you let it set overnight and let it dry. And this is almost a hundred percent dry and there is no remnant of any stench or stink. We even put the snage up to it for the, the old smell test. And you know what it smells like? Fresh. So, um, so that's what happened there. 
but I need to wait for another time when, hi, Green. Oh, hi, Brandon. I need to wait for another time when, um, to show that hack. But um, the vinegar, the vinegar goes in, at, um, at uh, oh, what is the word? It neutralizes everything. And so it, there's no stench and um, the peroxide and the blue vinegar working together. Let me tell you what happened. True story. In my other cabin, before it burned down, oh, I know bubbles, cleaning with vinegar is the absolute bomb. Um, but before my other cabin, uh, cabin burned down, I was staining wood because it was just like this. It was all blonde. And so I was staining wood. And I had mm, stupid calamity had the bucket of stain on the little tray that um, where the ladder is, you know? And well, I the, one of the dogs ran into it and the bucket went, pew, spilled all over and I had a white carpet in that bedroom. No joke. And I even have witnesses to say this is true. The Blue Dawn with the hydrogen peroxide mixture, it took it out. The dark, walnut stain in the white carpet it all came out yeah couldn't believe it that's when i became a huge a huge fan of dawn but then when i discovered this that made me go okay we have a problem dawn and i would like an explanation because um i'm not the only one that is falling for this and I know it's not a mistake because you cannot put anything out that on your, you're supposed to, um, everything is supposed to get, uh, be transparent, unlike the politicians, but to be transparent and everything goes on the back label, right? Well, not with those. So, um, that is what um, my problem. And so I also had a problem with rhesus. I've made a short about it um, because I don't have the, the uh, what happened with the candy anymore. But I also made a short about that one. It's um, uh, some, something called uh, we rhesus, we have to have a talk or something like that. Where's my water? Um, and so... Uh, anyway, I mean, it's, it's, you know, this is, we're talking money. You guys, my computer died. So I don't know what is, um, going on anymore on my command central died. Calamity has given us the grit on soap. <laughs> right. Right. Yeah. So, um, yeah, I'm trying to have your backs. Because you know what? You guys all have mine. You guys all have mine. I know it. How shout out to Procter and Gamble. <laughs> right? <laughs> oh, you guys. So anyway, um, your America changed the labeling. Guilty. America is guilty of a lot of things that we're finding out lately, aren't we? Mm. I wish I had a political channel. I'm thinking of making a political channel because I like politics. I like to talk politics. So, but anyway, um, so look at this. And oh, nice and. Oh, this is beautiful. There's a couple chunks of the tomato in there. And I think I'm going to leave it. I think I'm going to leave it. Now, do we have a taste? Hey, Joanna, hi. You guys, my command central died, so I can't really, I can't go back and look in the back chat. 
Um, New Orleans, what are they getting hammered for, honey? I did, Uncle, uh, um, ground uncle. You're old enough to be not my grandpa. <laughs> uh, please speak your mind. I went last two weeks in politics. They would eat me up, but I like to talk politics. Yeah. Oh, the hurricane is hitting it right now. Oh, geez, Louise. Oh, in New Orleans on September 11th. Interesting. I just find that interesting for my rate of reasons. Okay, let's uh, taste our soup because Grandpa Leroy wants us to. Huh, Grandpa? Huh, Leroy? Can I call you Grandpa? <laughs> Can I call you Grandpa? Reed Timmer. Oh, love me some Reed Timmer. That guy is awesome. He's afraid of nothing. Since the 9-11 attack. I know. Oh, my God. You guys, this is so good. This is really good. And it all started from that leftover pizza sauce. Mm. Oh, Joanne, are you serious? Mm. I have a friend. Um, I did a, a interview with him. You guys might want to watch it. Um, it was uh, one of my life programs. <gasps> Ken, wait a minute. It's Ken's birthday today. Is he around? Because I, you know, I have, you know, my, my your 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 friend, my kids. You sent my kids. To me, you and you and Ken. Would he like a birthday song or just a happy birthday? Um, Americans won't be influenced by a billionaire talking about Taylor Swift. He would like a birthday song. Okay, let's do it. And then I'll go out with that, okay? That's a good thing to go out on. <laughs> All right, Gracie, stop. Let me set up my little thing here, which will take me a moment. Yeah, but that's okay. Okay, just a secie. Okay, it's connected. And... Okay, and I need to um, happy birthday, 16 candles. Oh, God. Happy birthday, 16 candles, karaoke. Wow, it even knows that I'm a lower key. Okay. Ken, are you there, Ken? Okay, are we ready? I am. Sing a song for the night. You betcha. Okay. Uh -huh. No. Come on. <laughs> Here we go. Me, 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 me. Happy birthday. Happy birthday to you. 
birthday Ken and for everybody else who has a birthday happy birthday to you also has a birthday today I mean <laughs> so with that I just want to say so much to all of you thank you thank you very much and um, I will be back tomorrow in the kitchen. And tons, I'm going to be emailing you. And you and I need to connect so that we can make the interview happen on Tuesday with you. Okay. Oh, Ken, you're welcome. Happy birthday, sweetheart. Happy birthday. Oh, bubbles even sought. Okay, guys. Calamity out.